YouTube, welcome back to another video, and today we are going to be going over how to get free intros and outros for free. I know I said free twice, alright, but let's get to it. Alright, first thing for first things first, you wanna go into your browser and you wanna type in panzoid.com. You probably that won't pop up for you the slash creations because I've been there multiple times. Pansy.com and then you'll be brought here. Once you are here, you want to click on Clip Maker, and then you're only going to be given a few options for intros, so you might as well click more creations. And you can see there's a bunch of these that you can choose from. See all of them. Oh, I'm gonna turn my desktop volume down. That way, I don't get copyrighted. Okay. So my old one yes, was this one, and I would say if you like it, I skipped it quickly. And then you will just see this. You can move it around if you want, but you can't see much. The way to edit this is to do this. You want to click on this I button. You click the play button. And then it'll do it. Okay. And now, wait, let me see real quick. Alright, good. It's not recording that. Also, if you want to check out what this guy makes, his name is Chromave. You can go follow him on his website. And then when you go into this area, the objects section, you will see a bunch of Blah blah blah. All you want to find is the group that says text, and under it, it'll say a bunch of text, and whatever appears on the screen will appear what you put. So if I put Scorpio, then I'm just gonna copy that. Alright, enter. There you go, and it'll appear to something like that. And you can change the font if you want, but the person already has it on something, as you can see. It'll probably look best whenever a person has it on. And then your outro will be, or intro will be like this. That's all there is to it. And so we can XL that. Oh yeah, also, we're not done yet. I always, it depends on your laptop. I, of course, cannot, I don't think I'm going to be able to go either anything above 1080p. If I do, it probably will not work. So I'm going to do 720p. And I'm going to put it on 60 frames per second. I'm also going to edit how long the video is. You can do that if you want. Alright, so... Anything else you would like to do, you don't really have to edit anything else besides all these. Nothing to do here. Then after you're all done with that, you go down here. You can also change the music by clicking an audio file if you want. And then I always do good quality. MKV. And then I start the video render. And then that will download your video. Then it will open up a new tab with it downloaded and then yeah that's pretty much straightforward <laughs> there are outros I don't like the ones that just stand still there's nothing to them they're just there nothing exciting now this one I suggest this one to somebody because it looks pretty good look at this That looks pretty good. I would use that, but I like the one that you have right now. I actually might consider that one. Intros. So many intros here. Ooh, that one's pretty cool. Ooh. 
Whoa. All right, recommended for somebody who wants that. And if you don't, you don't want to look through here, all you have to do is this. Click on the search bar and type in outro. And then you will get so many options. And yeah, that's all there is to it. And then you put them into your videos with shortcuts. I bet you need a demonstration. Like I said, go check out the video that I made. Link in the description for how to edit videos. And it'll tell you how to download shortcut. Link is in the description on that video to download shortcut. Hope you got all that. Let me load up shotgun and show you. All right, now that we're on Shotcut, here's what you want to do. You want to click Open File, and then you want to do the one you wanted to do. So for me, my intro is this. So then I first need to add video, add a video, and in total, you will probably need, oh, whoops. Whoops. Uh, where's my video? Oh, we're, we're good. I always do video, video, and video. And then I have three videos. One is my intro, another one is my actual video, and the third one is my outro. But I can sometimes have multiple clips. Not a problem. Just add one and one more. Also, if you have an audio file, not a problem. You can add audio files, as many as you want. So, a quick demonstration of what, how this works. Oh, no, I already did it. I already made a video on this. Go check out the video link in the description. And then, yeah. That's all I need to say. Hope you all enjoyed, and leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Later.